Hello everyone, welcome back to High Mathematics. Real quick video today. We have 5 factorial all over 5 with double factorial sign. So how can you find this, this answer? On the first side, we will know that 5 factorial it will be equal to 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 and times 5. So we will know that this will be equal to 20 times 6. It will be equal to 120. But what about our denominator? Right here we have 5 is double factorial sign. So it looks like 5 is double factorial sign. It will be 5 factorial and we once more will have factorial. So 120 factorial. But this is if this is not correct. So I'll show you why. So in mathematics, the double factorial of a number n, for example, denoted by n with double factorial, is the product of all positive integers up to n that have the same parity, odd or even as n. <coughs> for example, add is, is odd number. Then we multiply odd or all odd number by, until this n. So take a look, for example, we have 7 factorial with double factorial sign. So 7 with double factorial sign, this is our odd number. So we go to this 7 using only odd numbers. So 1 times 2, or 1 times 3, times 5, and times 6. So times 7. So as you can see, we go only by odd numbers. So in our case, we have 5 is double factorial. So right here, it will be equal to 15 times 7 and it will be equal to 105. And let's go with this 5 is double factorial. Let's find it. We will have 5 is our odd number. So we go to this 5 using only odd numbers. So 1, then not 2, but 3, and then not 4, but 5. So 5 is double factorial. It will be equal to, it will be equal to 15. So let's go to, to this to this, uh, to this answer. So I write it as a product. So 5 factorial, 1 times 2 times 3 times 4 and times 5, it will be easier for us. And right here in our denominator 1 times 3 times 5. So 1 times 3 and times 5. So 3, 3, 1, 1, 5, 5 and we will have 2 and 4, it will be equal to 8. So as you can see it's not, this case is not like 120 over 120 factorial, we have a really good, really good answer. So if you still have any question, write a question in the comment, write a suggestion in the comment, it will be really nice to read it, write about you, you know it or you don't know, it will be really nice for me to read it as well. So thank you for watching and see you in the next videos.